The topic on sickle cell and dentistry is actually just showing the lack of data <laughs> and that this is an area where we're just wondering whether people know about uh, before a person with sickle cell gets dental care, where they might need to get prophylactic antibiotics, especially for those who've had a hip joint replaced, an artificial hip that might get infected more often than others. It turns out there's not much evidence there. And so we just point out that there's <clears throat> guidelines for other conditions that antibiotics are not necessary, so you don't have to do overdo the antibiotics. But there are certain situations where a person with sickle cell who also has diabetes or previous infection or severe immunocompromise of their cell-mediated immunity probably should have antibiotics. And those are part of the regular dental guidelines, orthopedic guidelines.